hello guys this is sort of with my friend kapil and here's the video to compress your mattress in three simple steps here we go hey guys i got these storage logic mattress vacuum bags um i was under the impression that we can only compress the four mattresses but we recently packed one of the spring mattresses as well and there's a uh, this this vacuum bag is from different company but this one is from storage logic uh, this is twin twin XL size, and now you can show us uh, the mattress. This, this is a oh foam. Oh, this is not foam. This is spring mattress. So now we're going to compress it. There is no information on any website that the vacuum bag can also compress the spring mattress. So today we thought let's try with the spring mattress because I had two mattresses and I'm moving out. So this is a bag and this is I would say awesome bag. It comes with this whole vacuum bag along with two strips or stripes whatever and it comes with these labels. You can put labels on that and name it. And that's pretty much it also comes with these zip zippers. These small zip lock, I don't know what you call these sliders, and you can lock, uh, you can zip your, your mattress quite tight with these. Alright, so <clears throat> me and my friend are going to now, now going to work on compressing these spring mattress. So now the first step is open this vacuum bag quite easy right. and now I'm going to stand this mattress like this I hope it's going to be a stable one now with one hand, I'm just going to cover it on top of it. Now I have to throw this mattress on the floor. And just, yep, that's pretty much okay. So now I'm going to use my, those little cute Yeah, these are the ones, and I'm going to put it here, and then I just keep wiping. From one direction to another direction. One and two and another. Okay. That's it. And I'll just press the corners and I'll double check. It's good if you press this this little cute device and then because I initially I didn't press it, so there is there was a gap. And now I'm pressing it, so it's going to make a tight seal from one end to another end. Alright. It comes out, don't worry, you can slide it in without pressing and then start from the end from the spot where you left. Alright, it seems tight to me. I'll just make sure one important thing that we learned of during the packing of these, uh, you know, compressing these mattresses is that you need to keep this suction cup. Um, right on the top of the mattress. It should not be lying somewhere here, right? It should be on the top. The reason because the bottom surface of this uh, vacuum bag gets stuck with this and it does not let you suck in here uh, using vacuum. So we're just using a normal vacuum uh, cleaner uh, that has a round hole. You, you need that because it just only takes the round hole uh, Holes. Um, okay, so that's pretty much. 
and now I'm going to turn on my vacuum. And within uh, four to five minutes, you can see this whole metal will be compressed. But make sure you have your friend or family member who actually walk on top of the metal. Actually, compressing without the need of it. I think I compress better than better than walking on top of it. Right? Evenly. But evenly compressed. Yeah, I showed you the, the frame. And that's pretty much. And the next step would be rolling over this mattress. You need two people for that and make sure specifically for spring mattress. Hey guys, so, so before we roll over this mattress after compressing it, don't forget to lock with this lid. Make sure it's snug and tight. Yep. So yeah, and now we have to roll over. Specifically for spring, mat spring mattress, you need two people. The four mattress, even for four mattress, you need two people, but four mattress is quite easy to come to roll over. But this one takes extra force because there are springs and the springs have more repulsive force than, uh, this is twin size, so maybe I'm, I'm able to roll over because my friend is taking video. So. And let me try. You have to crawl basically. I think I need my friends help. Yeah, he's a strong guy. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Yes. Yes! <laughs> we did it. You can the, see. These are the one, right? Yep. So these are the straps. All right. So nothing fancy. Just put right underneath mm. just by lifting it up a little bit all right I got it and then you'll pass it through both the buckles make sure you keep it in the middle not middle actually and then pass it through one of the buckles Right here, right? Yep. Oops. There is a knot. I need to clear that. to both the buckles and 
and then underneath one of the boxes. the other one yep hi guys so after learning from two previous compressions <laughs> we are now throwing these if you need help you can call us <laughs> now we are professionals <laughs> IT professionals We go. Yeah. And this is handy. So maybe the other, maybe the other side. Yep. Yeah. Because this has a zip lock. No, though you have to rotate. Okay. Yeah, we don't want to keep this zip locker on the bottom in the bottom because if it if gets open, if it opens, then yeah, you're done. All right. So. Two springs and one foam. Yeah, so the bigger one is the foam one and these two are spring ones. So I would, I'm sure this will last for a few months. Yep. All right, so now my friend will roll over the compressed mattress. The spring one does take a lot of force. So I'm asking my friend. Yeah, so you need to be very careful keep it straight so that it does not come out in a weird shape on one side all right Three in a row, two no. springs, upside down, and one foam. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Yeah, it's every mattress takes around four to five minutes. Um, nothing more than that. So yeah, I would definitely recommend to get these vacuum bags. It's easy to carry these compressed mattresses anywhere you want you can put in your sedan you put in your coupe wherever you want you don't need to have a bigger trucks or something like that that's just that will save you a lot of money not even a u-haul yeah i'm moving to boston so yeah that's pretty much thanks <laughs> guys as you already have seen the compression over twin sized spring mattresses here's the process of compressing the queen sized foam mattress where I'm walking on the mattress while the compression going on but uh, you don't really need to do it until you want it to do it fast and make sure that you strap your mattress tightly thanks for watching please support by like share and subscribe